Sin and redemption are two of the most profound themes in the Bible, touching the very essence of what it means to be human. But what is sin? And how does redemption offer us the path to forgiveness? The Bible teaches that sin is a universal condition. We all fall short of God's perfect standard. Romans chapter 3 verse 23 reminds us, For all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. This isn't just about individual mistakes, it's about a deep-seated nature that separates us from our Creator. But the story doesn't end with sin. The Bible also tells of a God who is rich in mercy and love. Psalm 103 verses 8 to 10 describe Him as compassionate and gracious, slow to anger, abounding in love. God's desire is not to condemn us, but to forgive and restore us. Central to this message of forgiveness is the sacrifice of Jesus Christ. John chapter 3 verse 16 declares, For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only Son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life. Jesus' death on the cross was the ultimate act of love, offering redemption to all. Forgiveness is available to everyone, but it requires a response, repentance and faith. Acts chapter 3 verse 19 urges us, Repent then and turn to God so that your sins may be wiped out, that times of refreshing may come from the Lord. Repentance is a turning away from sin, a decision to walk in a new direction. When we confess our sins and place our faith in Jesus, God promises to forgive us. 1 John chapter 1 verse 9 assures us, If we confess our sins, He is faithful and just and will forgive us our sins and purify us from all unrighteousness. This is the heart of the gospel, the good news that no sin is too great for God's grace. No matter where you are or what you've done, the path to forgiveness is open to you. God's love is greater than any sin and His forgiveness is always within reach. All it takes is a heart willing to turn to Him.